Hello everybody, Swaminath here. Today we are going to see SAP MM EWM AST sales and distribution. That is inbound delivery. And I'm going to put away the material in EWM and I'm going to pick the material from EWM warehouse and going to sell it to the customer and build the customer. MM EWM SD integration, project execution. This is a real time project execution. Let's go to the process. MM. Inbound delivery. Next, EWM. I'm going to put away the material. Finally, I'm going to sell the material to SD, sales and distribution. Okay, this is SD. SD, sales and distribution. Okay. Now, let's go to the system directly. Now, this is my system. S4 system. Okay, EWM system. Okay. See, uh, EWM is available only in S4. EWM is available again. I repeat, EWM extended warehouse management is available only in the S4 system, not in ECC system anymore. Okay, let's go to I'm going to create a purchase order ME 21 year. Okay, let me enter the supplier, enter purchase organization 145 is my vendor. I'm going to buy the material from the vendor Adani. Okay, enter. Material. Enter plant DF01. It's my plant. Enter quantity. I'm going to enter only one quantity. Enter storage location. Now I'm going to enter the storage DF01. It's my storage location. Press enter. Now click onto this confirmation. Okay. Inbound. Select this inbound. Okay. Only then you will be able to put away the material in the warehouse. Save it. Let me take this purchase order. Let me take this purchase order. I'm going to do inbound delivery. Let me do inbound delivery. Slash and slash and BL 31N. BL 31N. It's my inbound delivery. I'm going to do inbound delivery. See? Purchase order has been adapted. This is my purchase order. PO. It's been adapted. Okay. Press enter. Now I'm going to do inbound delivery. Just save it. See, one quantity has come. This is my material. Just save it. Okay. Now let me come. This is my inbound delivery. 18004264. 4264 is my material. It's my inbound delivery, sorry, IBD. We call it IBD, inbound delivery. Okay, let's go to, come back. Okay, this is my inbound delivery. There it is. See here, PRD. Slash and either you can directly go from the favorites or type it directly. Slash and slash SC WM slash PRDI. Inbound delivery. Present. Enter the inbound delivery number. Execute. See here, inbound delivery has come to the EWM system. Now, let me unload this material. Let me do goods receipt here itself. See, unloading completed. And goods receipt is also completed. Unloading completed, goods receipt also completed. Now, select. let me select onto this and do confirmation. Let me put away in the bins. Warehouse task. I'm going to put this in the warehouse task. Create. See here. I'm going to place the stock here. Slash 20 in the final bin. My storage type is 0020. And my destination bin is 0020-02-05-03. Select onto this. Create and save. Let me create and save. Confirm it here itself. Let me do confirmation here itself. So I have placed the material in the bin. Confirm plus save. I am just placing the material. Confirmation. Confirmed. I am just placing the material here. Okay. Now come back. Let's come back. Now I am going to do outbound delivery. SD. Sales and distribution. SD. I'm going to pick the material from EWM, 
send it to the customer. Okay, pick the material from EWM and send it to the customer. Let's go to, let's me, let me create a sales order. Order confirmation, PA01. OR is my order type, press enter. Enter the sold to party. Enter customer reference, SD, OBD, OBD. Okay, payment terms, let me enter import terms. Import terms. Okay, now we enter the material. 36, Z3636 is my material. Order quantity, one. Okay, now double click onto this line item. Let me give the pricing. I haven't given the pricing. PR00. 1100 rupees. 1100 rupees. I am going to sell this material. 1100 rupees to the customer. Go to shipping tab. Enter plant. Enter storage location. DF02 this time. Available for sales. DF02. Enter net weight and gross weight. Now go to scheduling schedule lines. Enter the confirmed quantity. Now let me save this. Yes, it's asking for dates. Edit. Loading date, metal available date, transportation date, and GR date. Goods issue date, sorry. Today's date. I'm entering today's date. All date, today's date. Come back and let me save this. Let me save this. So I have done order confirmation. 293 is my sales order number. I have done order confirmation to the customer. Let me go, go back. Go to VL01. Now I'm going to do OBD. Outbound delivery. Outbound delivery. Here. OBD. Outbound delivery. OBD. Outbound delivery. Here it is. IBD. IBD. Inbound delivery. Here it is. Put away and picking. Put away and picking. Put away is material putting away in the warehouse. Picking is I'm going to pick the material from the warehouse and sell it to the customer. Okay. Now let's go to PL01 here. PL01 here. See, 293 is my order. Press enter. Okay, you don't have to do anything here. Picking, you cannot do it here. Picking, you have to do it in EWM. Okay, post, you cannot do post goods issue also here. Goods issue will be done in EWM. Save it. So, distributed to 8 OBD. OBD is saved, was saved and distributed to WMS, Faro's Matches. Okay, let me and take this OBD. OBD. Okay, now let me go to the system. Now it is EWM system. I'm going to pick it from the EWM system, sell it to the customer. Send it to the customer. Okay, now PRTO. Either you can directly go from here or slash and slash SCWM slash PRTO. Okay, outbound delivery. See here, outbound delivery. Enter the Outbound delivery number. Execute. See, it has come. Outbound delivery. Now, what I'm going to do is go to outbound delivery. Thing. Order. Follow on function. Warehouse. I'm going to pick the material. Okay. Let me do create. Click on to create here. See here. Now, the material has been picked Material has been picked. See here, 0, 02 dash 0. It has been picked from 03 dash 01 dash 03. It's been picked. Okay. Now, let me do create plus save. Okay. Now, warehouse task, confirm it. Confirm it. I'm just picking the material from the bin from the bin which I have shown you earlier. When you confirm it, it will be picked. Material will be picked. Picked. Okay, see here. It's been I have to do confirm plus save. So once when I do confirm plus save, it's a open, it's an open status. Okay. 
it will be picking from the pin. Once when I do confirm, it will be picking from the pin, which I have shown you earlier. See here. Well, when you go to form view, let's go to form view and check. It will be picking from this source pin. Okay, let me confirm this. Confirm plus save. Once when we do confirm it, it's confirmed. The arrow starts to be created. Now come back. Come back. Okay. Now you can do load and boots issue to the customer. Load. See it? I just loaded it. Boots issue to the customer. Right? Now come back and save the billing in S4 system. VF0. Press enter and save it. So customer billing has been done.